All right, guys. <laughs> Welcome to the BK Show. We're Is not it? good at this. <laughs> right. Are we recording? <laughs> I tried so hard. Do we need like an introduction though? Like. Yeah. Introduction. Restart. <laughs> Welcome to the BK Show by Weedix Western. Hey guys, I'm Tam Carl. I'm BK Show. And we are going to bring you guys some product reviews, unboxing, questions. Some wild questions. Don't forget about the questions. Yeah. If you have questions, throw them at us. Yeah, so let's get into it. Shameless. Why is Shameless? Because if you've seen Shameless, Frank Gallagher is always in the sticky situation. And oh, that- All right, Frankie. Yeah, okay, Frankie. That little uh, squad always gets them out of their pickles, always. Dunked That's in a true. river, saved. The Gallaghers always come through. Yeah. I'm going with The Office. Imagine this, you're tied up on a boat, kidnapped, where are you going? Antarctica, you don't know. Oh no, you hear something. Someone's running down the hallway. It's Dwight. Dwight's coming through. He has his glasses on. He's the guy that's gonna save you nine out of 10 times. Next. Flight. Here's the thing. Superman. He flies. He flies. And you're afraid of heights, so I feel like, you know. I'm afraid, yeah. So if I fall, I could fly. Yeah. It's kind of like a famous quote. I like that. Mine would be invisibility, because Anxiety. Just That's creepy. Gone. Uh, I'm gonna have to say Skittles. Like, oh. just like Beast Mode, Marshawn Lynch, Skittles. Mm -hmm. Any time of the day, pop one, pop 15, feels good. Mine's probably salt vinegar chips. Old Vicky's? Old Vicks. Not bad. Is that Miss Vicks? Oh, yes. Old, old, old Dutch. Dutch. Old Dutch Miss, Miss Vicky's. <laughs> Chris Hemsworth. I can take him. Like, I'm not calling you out, but I can take you. Let's go. Join the Jake Paul fight. Like, this is opening act, opening fight. Let's go, Chris Hemsworth. Because even if I lose, I got knocked out by Thor. That's true. Isn't that awesome? That is true. I don't know if I would win, but I, I think fighting Jennifer Lawrence would be really funny. She's a beast. I know, that's uh, She's I, that's always I, in movies I where she I kills win, people. But her Every one liners time. would be funnier than the actual. That's true. Yeah. So even if you lost, it'd feel good. And because I'd like, win and yeah, that's true. I like that. Next, Amelia Earhart. That woman's got secrets, and I want to know them. No, that makes sense. Frankie. <laughs> All right, guys. Sorry, kitten back. I'm gonna have to say the old DB, Dale Brisby. Mm -hmm. Like, Abraham Lincoln would have been cool, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, but Dale, spurs bulls. Like, throws a bull rope on everything. He's the guy, come to Canada. Dale, we're waiting for you, come. <laughs> Rain and spur. It's basically like the skull and bones, the secret society, but it's cooler, all right? Imagine this, you got Tough Cooper, Dale Brisby, BK Show, Tam Carl, we're all in it. Like, we don't kill people, but we have a good time. Like, we crack Mountain Dews, Red Bulls, like, eat salt and vinegar chips, like... Skittles. Skittles! Skittles. Like, that's a secret organization I want to be a part of. What about you? I don't think I could follow that up. That is, that is Do you the, mean that? That like, is the secret society right. right there. So honestly, at this point, Follow, rain and spur. I'm just kidding. No, just, <laughs> no secret society yet. Maybe next year. Next. Year. next. 1967 Shelby GT 500 oh Super Snake Eleanor gone in 60 seconds in this. Guys, come on. American muscle. I'm not even American. I'm Canadian, but I feel it. I was just gonna say a bug. <laughs> A bug? Get is it gonna be a convertible or a hard top? No, it's gotta be convertible because you gotta get down. That's it. true. Mm -hmm. All right, last question. Nick Ferdamangus. <laughs> we'll drop the at, at Nick Ferdamangus. You know, you know. If you know, you know. 
know, you know, he's a man with a mustache. <sighs> German. Yeah, German. Dark, tall, handsome, dad bod. It's everything you want. Drives a big old 16 hand gray horse. If you don't know, you need to now know. Now you know. Drop the handle right here. I don't know if you can put it. No, right here. Let's put it right go. here. Drop handle at Nick Ferd Mangus. <laughs> Other than Nick Ferd Mangus, hmm. Will Ferrell. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, Will Ferrell would be good. Like I just feel like he would probably share the story pretty good, the way he would talk about it. Yeah, the reenactment. I mean, yeah, there'd be a movie made after it. Yeah. So Will Ferrell. Nice. Cut. Cut. That was good. Guys, I feel like that was good for our first one. I think it was good enough. Yeah, like let's go. <laughs> All right, guys, we're here to review our first product of the BK Show. What's it gonna be? I don't know. Three, two, one. This is big. This is big. Can I trap boo, baby? <laughs> if you don't know, you will know. These are big. These are bad. They're important. Also, Brad's Christmas present, so. Don't tell them that. <laughs> It's a sponsor. It's not sponsored. It's not sponsored. <laughs> not an ad. No ad on top of no. the Instagram post here. No. It's unbelievable. Open that box. All right, guys. First look. First look. Take a look. Dum. Da dum. BK had these on his Christmas list for a reason. And what was that reason? Simplicity. Yeah. All right. In Canada, we get a lot of snow, a lot of water, a lot of moisture, and it's cold. And the reason I wanted these, they're actually insulated boots. And I like that they have the rubber on the bottom because a lot of the time, it doesn't matter if you're on the horse or not, in Canada, you're gonna get some snow yeah. all over your toes and it's gonna be get cold. Yeah, the number one thing I think for ranching or anything Western with cowboy boots, in the winter is your toes freeze. So Absolutely. Freeze. So what's what's the first thing you like about this boot other than that? Other than being waterproof. Waterproof and, and warm. warm. Well, so these ones are, they're full lace up all the way up to like, under, right under your knee, hey? Yep, and they're nice and high. So with that, you can tuck your jeans right into these and then they're not gonna get the snow that comes up the front of these, as well as you're not gonna get the snow all over the bottoms of your jeans that then your wife gets to deal with in the house. She always deals with them. <laughs> you know when you like pull your jeans up and all of the snow falls yeah. out and it's like a small avalanche? Yeah. That, that won't happen with these. Nope. So my favorite part, oh, sorry, I'm getting old. All right, guys, my favorite part, I'm not gonna fully put these spurs on, but I'll give you a sample. These have a nice little spur ridge, as you can see right here. So if you're riding pasture, riding colts, just having fun, riding, enjoying, going out with some friends, you can wear your spurs with these. Yeah. They're not gonna fall off, because sometimes boots with that are built this kind of small and a little yeah. tighter to your foot, the spur slides down the back. Yeah, so these are built with the safety in mind of the cowboy wearing them, versus some of the other styles of the Kenetrex that they have are strictly for just wearing outside in the snow and not meant for riding purposes, but that is what these ones are for. Lastly, one thing I really like too, Boof, you see that? You're not gonna eat it like you would. Traction. <laughs> your Traction boots. is important. Yes. Cowboy boots, you're like, you're signed down Mount Everest. Yeah. You walk out the side of this barn right now, oof, yeah. you're gone. So yeah. the cool thing with these, they do have traction. Yeah. You won't slip and die. You will not get injured. So you don't have to stay home. Would you say that they Other than fit, for COVID. Um, would, you, yeah. would you say that they fit true to size? They fit true to size. They fit a little bigger but I like to order a size bigger. That's why we got 11s here, because yeah. I usually wear 10s. Yeah. But I did get a little bigger just because I wear another insulated big wool sock underneath yeah. in the winter time. So it keeps my feet super warm no matter where I am. Mm -hmm. They're perfect. Yeah. These are the Kenetrek Cowboys. Yeah. I was back and forth with the Kenetrek Cowboys and the Ranchers, but what sold me was the spur deck on this because I knew you'd be riding in them, so. We definitely recommend these boots. These are not, given to us, we did, we actually bought these because we know they're awesome. 
I wanted them. She wanted me to get them for Christmas. They came a little late, <laughs> awkward. <laughs> but you'll see them all the time now on Instagram, stories, anything. If there's certain products that you want to see, comment below, tag the brand below, and we will share it and we will review it. Thanks for tuning in, guys. We appreciate it. Let us know how we did.